Welcome back to Good Morning Colorado. This is a look at Colorado College this morning. It's really looking so nice outside. Kind of looks like it's almost noon time, but it really is only 638. But we might see some changes later on this afternoon. Let's get a check on the weather forecast with the person who can tell us from Check of 13's Marty V. Marty, what can we expect today? And good morning, Kershaw. Well, we can expect some late day showers and thunderstorms for sure. Again, there's very little sign of that right now. Just a few clouds around, birds flying around there, community banks in Colorado. We're in the mid to upper 50s on the Palmer Divide this morning, so it's a comfortably cool morning. We do expect to get pretty warm here before any storms arrive, though. Mixture of 50s and 60s in eastern Colorado right around now. You can still find some 30s. You just have to get up real high to do it. Leadville's 35 at the moment. But we still have some 40s over the mountain valleys where the air is a little bit drier. Future cash shows we will be fine through about lunchtime or so, but the first showers may begin developing over the mountain areas around that time or shortly thereafter. Into the early afternoon hours, that's where most of the activity should remain. Uh, through 4 o'clock, though, you start to see the first cells spilling out across the I-25 corridor as well. Not too much of this is expected over the far eastern plains through this time frame, but a little later on into this evening, into tonight, you'll have a chance for some rain as well. High temperatures should reach the 80s from Colorado Springs northward mid 90s along the Arkansas River. So definitely a little bit cooler in the northern part of the state and that cold front and the low level moisture associated with it is the reason we think the storms will stay pretty widespread here through the evening hours. We'll expect a mixture of 70s and 80s over the mountains and mountain valleys again prior to storms arriving. So low to mid 80s should do it around Colorado Springs, maybe upper 80s for Fountain and Hanover today, generally 70s in Teller County. Storms not likely to be severe today, but certainly could produce frequent lightning Plenty of gusty wind, some bursts of heavy rain, and they'll cool the temperatures off considerably as they come by. It'll take a little longer for those things to get around to the Pueblo area, so I think you'll hang on to the low to mid 90s here for longer into the afternoon. Back to the higher terrain, we'll look for a mixture of 70s and 80s. Again, that's prior to storms arriving. Looks like the strongest storms will probably be up to our north today, so we're not terribly concerned about severe weather, but wouldn't rule out maybe one storm approaching severe criteria, perhaps producing some hail close to an inch in diameter or some thunderstorm wind gusts that could approach 60 miles an hour. Notice, by the way, a pretty good coverage of showers and thunderstorms coming off the mountains here through this evening. Uh, the bright colors suggesting some heavy rain, at least in pockets. Of course, we can't promise everybody gets it, but this is pretty widespread activity. And wave one kind of goes by and notice another second wave comes by uh, later on tonight. So there could be some showers going well into the wee hours of the morning in some cases, but most of this should be on the downswing by the time you wake up tomorrow morning. And when you do, we'll once again be in the 50s to around 60 in much of eastern Colorado with some colder air up across the mountains and mountain valleys. Highway 115 at Turkey Creek looking at some blue sky at least for now. Uh, we're going to have a real warm week ahead with some periods of wind and generally daily showers and thunderstorms, which doesn't mean it'll rain everywhere. And some days we'll probably have more of them than others. And we'll talk about that in our extended forecast coming up soon. And it was kind of funny earlier in your weather. You saw that little moth flying around. Yeah, <laughs> it was flying around in front of my face here. There's definitely a couple of studio. Yeah, you held your composure. You would just keep going. I was like, oh, there as long as it goes. doesn't hit me in the face, <laughs> yeah. I probably won't play. Then you're good. All righty. Thanks, Marty. You're welcome. Uh, we've been